Hey guys, so I am back with a video and it's a um it's a haul video as you can tell by the title on here and it is basically to try to um start my spiritual business. I already have some stuff going up, but I wanted to get a couple of things and um restock on some stuff because I'll be using my stuff. But um because I am like really in this life, I'm about that life. So without any further ado i'm gonna go through the things that i went ahead and got so one thing that i got was this here dragon's blood um i love the smell of dragon's blood i love the properties of it and we are going to actually use this in an oil that me and jay marie came up with to make um a dragon's blood candle so be on the lookout for that we're like super excited the only thing that i haven't been able to find that i wanted to put in that was actually dragon's blood crystals so i'm probably gonna have to order those online because i wasn't able to find them at any of the stores that i went to um next i got some candles and these are like so cute like i love skulls and they probably like kind of creepy but I love skulls. So um, these are head skulls and you can use these to do like um, work to mess with someone's mind. Um, it could be good or bad. I mean, depending on how you call it. Some people call it right hand, left hand, whatever. Um, I don't, I don't want to use the terms black magic, white magic because I'm mm -mm, as a as a black woman, no, black magic is not evil. So no, not using that. Um, so anyhow, you can use this to like mess with people's heads. Like if someone mess with you, if somebody's causing problems, you can use it for that. Or you could even use it like on yourself um, to put in like love for yourself, to help you gain strength, clarity, whatever you wanna do, anything that has to do with the mind. And these ones here, I got candles, um, it's a red uh, breakup candle. So it's basically like, I mean, I guess you could use it to break other people up. I don't do stuff like that. But like if you're in a relationship with someone and you just know that it's over and maybe it's toxic or whatever, but you have that trauma bond or you have soul ties or whatever and you want it to be done, this would be yo candle right here and then oh this is a back-to-back -back one too i guess i grabbed by mistake so this is a back-to-back and -back black which is the same thing but i also have the ones where they're facing each other which i thought i grabbed and that's for love so like when they're facing each other it's love when they're back to back it's um breakup and then they also which i didn't get but they have single candles um that you can use to do work like this i guess like if you want to work on yourself if you want to help somebody they have a single candle which will represent yourself or that person that you're trying to put the um that work on um i also got these little singing bowls here which i'm not good at it but uh, i thought they were cool like i would love the bigger ones but they're like, like, see, I can't even, my husband can do it. Yeah. My, my singing bowl game is, y'all, you know what, too? I was watching the video and they said, there it goes. So yeah, those are pretty cool. So we'll be using those in the house to help that vibe, clear out that nastiness. I also got these candles again. They just all come in like red and black. These look like, but these are called like seven knot candles and it's to do spell work for like, um, woo, shouldn't be doing that, for good luck. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, I guess, down here. But um, it's to do like wish work, spell work for like good luck and like different stuff, I guess, if you wanna do negative spell work, you could probably use these to do that too, whatever you do with your magic. Um, I also got for the water i love this stuff i have it like literally right here and this little spray bottle i'm not um 
too great with scents but i can handle this baby i use it with my um tarot deck i use it to like lift the vibe when i'm doing different things and i love it i also got rose water which um this one says you could use like on your skin and stuff like that and then the ingredients weren't too too bad so i just thought why not it was a decent price i'll try it and use it in some of my you know spell work i also got this was just agua de kinga um and while i was in there i i seen it at like more than one store and i'm like what is that what is that so i googled it and it said um this like florida water basically and that people like black people black people tend to use it um is what it said at first I didn't like the smell, but not too, too bad. I'll have to try it out, see how it works. But, um, so we'll see. I'll see how, you know, it works with me and everything like that. I like to put it in like, um, floor washes. Um, you know, like I have it in my spray, spayed around the house, different stuff like that. So then I also got this book, Power. I can read Power of Psalms. <laughs> and it has like different Bible verses from um, the Bible. Oh my gosh, my brain is everywhere. So it has different verses and then it kind of like breaks it down like um, what you can use. Like it has um, Psalms 30 and then it says to become patient, gratitude for many blessings in times of sickness. So, um, it just tells you um, ways that you can use it. And I mean, with magic, of course, if you're a witch, you know, you can use magic however works for you. But that's how the book breaks it down. And I haven't, of course, I haven't read it yet. I got it a few days ago and it's like I'm backlogged on books. So I will be getting to it, though, so that I can start using that in my work. And then um, I also got some bowls I got round ones and I also got a heart and I'm so excited because I like well I don't have them on today but I usually wear um crystal bracelets and this is like a little charging bowl I could just set it on my dresser charge them overnight while I'm not wearing them and then um you know, go on about my business. So, super excited about those. Sorry for all that noise. And then I also, of course, got um, crystals. I like bagged them. <laughs> Only got a couple of each. I got some rainbow moonstone, lapis. Um, let's see. Cornelian right here. Got some, I think it's Lepidolite. Some of them I don't know how to pronounce, but these are like so gorgeous to me. I thought they were really pretty. And I got um, Tectite, I think that's how you pronounce it. I know it's like in these bags. And then I got some Obsidian. I myself personally like a lot of the, um, like black crystals are like a lot of them have to do with like absorbing your negative energy and stuff like that so i really really like crystals that are black this is um tourmaline those are pretty gorgeous let me see I'm trying not to make the video too too long i'm almost done but it's gorgeous little pieces i actually use these on my um tarot deck to make sure like no negative um spirits get in i have my tarot deck right here by me see i have a little piece of it on there and i like love that so i have like a bigger piece by my door um protect them bad spirits that try to enter and then this is tourmaline also i think i'm gonna steal a piece because i'm always taking my own stuff is so gorgeous this one's tumbled and i just thought it was super duper beautiful so 
Might be coming home. Well, it is home with me, but you know what I mean. Might be coming home with me. And then I've got a few more. Okay. I got some bloodstone, which I'm not really too, too much into green, but I thought these were pretty cool. Pretty pieces. Some rhodonite, and I really, I like the rhodonite. I don't know, it's like, it looks kind of creepy, kind of, but kind of not. It looks kind of like camouflage. And um, it's a really gorgeous stone. So many healing properties, so, so, so many with all of these. And oh, these look crazy like that. I got citrine. <laughs> gorgeous beautiful pieces and then I got some sunstone and some snowflake obsidian my daughter loves snowflake obsidian here's sunstone and I probably need a piece of that too because I don't have any and I really like it and um Yeah. So that's pretty much what I got when I went out and um, I don't know, I like low key feel like I need to go out again. Like, I don't know about y'all, but it just seems like since COVID time goes by really quick, I don't know, I feel like they're messing with the time. I'm just kidding. But uh, <laughs> it like the days go by so fast. So I don't know, I'm thinking about maybe going back down. But I really hope you guys enjoyed that quick little haul and into the next video. Bye.